You might have heard the CDC recently changed its guidance to allow fully vaccinated people to avoid quarantine if they meet certain criteria. But why did this change happen? Does it mean if you're vaccinated, you can't spread COVID? WCNC Charlotte's Vanessa Rufus verifies. Earlier this month, the CDC changed its guidance, allowing folks with COVID-19 exposure to skip quarantine if they've been fully vaccinated, had their second dose at least two weeks prior, but no longer than three months prior, and have no COVID symptoms. So what are the implications here? Our question is, does the quarantine guidance change mean researchers have proven you can't spread COVID if you're vaccinated? Well, we checked with the CDC, Mecklenburg Public Health's medical director, Dr. Dr. Meg Sullivan and Dr. Ashley Parrott, a physician executive with Novant Health. And we want to clarify that point. This is not a free card to get out in the world and do whatever we want to do after we've had two doses of vaccine. Even in its guidance, the CDC says it still doesn't know how much the vaccines reduce transmission and vaccinated people should keep following all the other safety protocols. Continue to wear masks, wear them appropriately, socially distance, avoid crowded areas, to monitor symptoms, stay home. So then why was the change made? Parrott says it comes down to benefits versus risks. The CDC says there is more to gain by not sidelining essential workers than there is to lose from this potential but unknown risk of transmission. A lot of this was related to getting people back to work, getting back to school eventually, hopefully with our school teachers, um, getting back to their regular day-to-day -day duties. So we can verify, no, the CDC's guidance change was not because researchers have proven the vaccines prevent COVID-19 transmission. It was a practical change to get essential workers back to work. With your Verify, I'm Vanessa Rufus.